hello guys welcome to my channel in this video we will be talking about how to use endnote and how to use it for references in this video we will be learning how to download citations from different sources and how to add those citations and use them as references and we will also learn how to remove references and welcome to my channel if you didn't subscribe please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel I have already installed EndNote in my computer and if you didn't install in your computer please watch another video for installing this. Uh, let's suppose in this example we have two paragraphs and we want to use EndNote for reference. Let's suppose uh, the first paragraph we need to cite like Pung et al 2018. As we know, manual writing of reference is very labor intensive job and it also cause problems later on if we need to submit our manuscript in any other journal after rejection from one journal. So in order to make reference style easier according to any journal, we will be using EndNote. Like common in reference, we need to use year, title, journal name, volume, and even the issue. We need everything to put. Um, if you have used EndNote for reference, then you can make it according to any journal very easily by using a single click. Any journal can be chosen just with a single click. Let's start by downloading the citation given for first paragraph. So what you need to do, you just need to open Google Chrome. Then you need to paste your title in the Google Scholar. Like for here, this paper, I am going to copy its title and then paste in Google Scholar. What you need to do, you just need to search. All the relevant papers would be opened. And here you need to click on double commas. It will open a window and then from these windows, out of several options, you can choose one and a note. It will automatically start of downloading of one file. You can double click and it will automatically open in already installed and note program. You can see here is downloaded and here are every details are given like authors, year, everything is mentioned. Here we can see all authors are given. Now we will going to insert that reference here at the end of this paragraph. We need to go to insert menu. And here we need to find that what we have downloaded. Like my gene name. I have already downloaded citations, so here they are showing three files. You can choose any option for search. You can choose any option like author name, title, journal name, whatever you want. You can search and find your desired citation. After finding the required reference, you can just click on insert button. You can see here the reference is automatically added. Piao et al. Sorry, the previous one was Piao et al. 
So at the end, we can see the reference are automatically inserted at the end. Let's suppose here we need to add another reference. So we need to put the cursor within the bracket after 2010. And you can go again in the insert menu and find any other reference which you like. Search, select and after that you can insert. After the insert button, you can see both citation and at the end reference are added. Now for second example, uh, we will download citation from journal website. Some good journal have already given citations tool for different softwares at their website like for this paper you need to go to the end of that paper you need to choose citation tools and then you can choose for endnote and you can download the citation and double click on it it will automatically integrate into endnote and here is your citation Again, all details are given, so you can go again and start to insert citation. Here is another example to download citation from journal website like this paper. We will choose and note and it will start downloading now you can put your citations at the paragraph end and you can find that using search option and find your required paper As like in this video, we have used three references, so all of them are given at the end. So that's all how to add reference. So before we go into next, we should must know how to delete the reference or how to change the reference like here. We want to remove this text was already used by hand. So these three references we will use. And let's suppose one of them we want to remove. So removing is little tricky in EndNote. If let's suppose if you have removed the first one, we can see that if you will update the bibliography, it will come again. So what we need to do to remove, first you need to go and select the reference and then you need to go to edit menu and select whatever you want to remove click on it and you can click on remove citations and click on ok so the reference is gone if you face any problem in using endnote please save me in comments and please subscribe to my channel